Hello and welcome back to PBQ. My name is Harmony and I'm here with Apostle Destin Thomas. So who is the third horseman and what is his significance? The third horseman is the, the rider of the black horse. Mm. Now remember the first one is the rider of the white yes. which is the Antichrist. Mm -hmm. And the second, the rider of the red horse, mm -hmm. um, which talks about wars. Now is the rider of the black horse. And this talks about farming. Now, as you will observe, wherever there is war, and war has been going on for a while, what comes next? Famine. You see, now, the scripture says here, he says, now, and when he had opened the third sail, and I heard the third be say, come and see, and I behold and lo, a black horse, and he that sat on it had a pair of balances like a scale, okay in his hand and a vo i heard a voice in the midst of the four saying, a measure of wheat for a penny and three measures of barley for a penny and see thou hot not the 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 the, 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 the and see thou hot not the sorry i'm just looking at the scripture here all right okay the oil and the wine all right now so what does this symbolize now there's going to be famine in the world as a result of all of these wars. Now, what would have cost somebody? Now, like take, for example, say a one pound would have cost you a packet of rice. Now, what is going to happen is that same packet of rice, you will need 10 pounds to get it. You know, so there's going to be a scarcity of food. Mm. Now, since 1914 to now, they said that about 70 million people have died during war. Now, that is going to increase during this particular time, probably goes up to, I mean, even more than a billion people. Mm. Yeah. And people are going to die of war, but I tell you, much more would even die out of starvation and out of hunger. And so that is who the rider of the black horse is. Now, you see, that's why he had this balance in his hand. You know, there are some, I mean, commentators who think that it, the balance of, I mean, it's talking about justice. No, it's a balance of scarcity of food. Wow. And so that is what is going to happen. And look at everywhere where war had occurred. Somalia and all of these places. Mm. What happens next? Yeah, funny. Funny. Yeah. Okay. You That's interesting that you yeah. say that. Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much. Yes. So that was the third horseman. The third horseman. Who exactly. is the, the dark he is 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 farming. He's just he's just farming. It's just farming. It's still oh. just farming. It's gonna happen upon the earth. Um, um but the Bible tells us something very significant as well. Mm. It said hot not the oil and the wine. Somehow during that period the famine might not affect the production of oil and wine. I don't know, maybe it's because of the kind of trees. I mean, that cannot be affected so much by pestilence or whatever. But somehow, it is going to affect wheat, barley. It's going to affect grain. Mm. I mean, rather than it being affecting, I mean, wine and, and oil. Okay. Yeah. All right, then. It's very interesting. It is. So, wh why? Why do you think that it's not um, the oil and wine? I don't know, but the Bible just says, see that you hope not. So, I think, I believe God has put um, a stop that that will not be tampered with. Mm. Yes. Okay, interesting. Yes. Yes. So that was the third um, horseman. Yes, exactly. And um, I shall speak to Apostle next time with the fourth horse. Yes. And this one is going to round up everything and everything will be answered. Yes. Thank you very much. Please like and comment this video. Please share it and also visit our website and email us for any questions you may have. Thank you and hashtag PBQ.